Alright, so here we are with uh, Left for Dead. Now, we ended up uh, stopping because you had stuff, and we had stuff, and yeah. I had stuff, you had, and stuff. had stuff, and there was everyone stuff. had stuff was, like, that was stuff doing for stuff. People doing stuff we had a bunch stuff. of stuff that we had to do, so we had to cut the game early. So, here's what I found out. You go to single player, mm -hmm. and there's a campaign, No Mercy. It turns out we have five chapters per campaign. I believe we stopped at the sewer, so it's your turn to do the hospital. Okay. And uh, so, like I said, this really isn't a game like I'm used to, like Resident Evil or something where you play through when you save, and when you reload the game, it kicks you back to where you're at. This is kind of like uh, maybe Call of Duty. Yeah. It's like you just pick a map and go through it. So, yeah. so far we've done the apartments, the subway, the sewer, and now we are going to the hospital, and we are on No Mercy. <sighs> yeah, and like I was saying, this game... We are used to playing games like Resident Evil and stuff like that, where you take your time, you go into an area, you explore, look around. Two Rock Evolution. Yeah. You look around, cool. Make you sure clear you collect everything, everything out. Yeah, collect everything, clear it out, and then you move on to the next area. However, this game, like I said, it acts more like Call of Duty. You get into a map and you just gotta go, 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 go from beginning to end. Hurry up, move, 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 go, yeah. go, go. All right, go, go, go. All right, so here. Whoa, there's a button for turn around. That's awesome. I didn't know that. Yeah, so right in here is where we can get extra weaponry. That guy died and his arm got caught in the door. Just clipping through. Okay, so, yeah, we're talking about the lack of specificity of control here. So, I cannot, like, shoot off his arm or anything. Yeah, like in Two Rock Evolution, you could shoot somebody's head off, shoot their arm off. Yeah, yeah, even in Two Rock Evolution, and this is, like, more, way more advanced than Two Rock Evolution. Mercy Hospital is overrun. So apparently, from what I gathered, this is an Easter egg. Bitch. If you go back and look, it says, I killed 63, 77, 104, 109, 53,000. Now, oh, that 53,595, that's from another game. I don't remember what is it is. It? It's like, left. this is Left for Dead. It's like Dead Rising, <laughs> or from some other game, the maximum kill you can get is 53,594. Uh-huh. And that's why when they put 595, oh. they're like, it's lies. That's funny. <laughs> lies. <laughs> X is used to pick stuff up, and then oh, there's, hit it. there's a melee attack. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> the clipping in this game is just crazy. I, I'm sorry, I like to look at like the um, the actual <laughs> mechanics, game mechanics, because it can get pretty ridiculous sometimes. Like, look at that. Especially, I like that. Look, look how the the ripples appear on the glass. Yeah, that looks really cool. Huh? Is that Andy Oakley or what? It looks like a whatever John Wayne. Kind of looks like the, the Duke or something. Yeah. Oh, grab that Pistol. so you can wield dual pistols. Yeah. And now you can pick up another weapon. So then you have... There we go. Because otherwise, usually you have one pistol and then your <laughs> big giant weapon. Is there a zoom in on this? No. Yeah, and like, like I said, that's what is weird is because this... From what I get, this is a Valve game and Valve made Portal. <laughs> Look at that. Like, all that detail into it. But... You still can't pick anything up. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for scaring them all. I'm trying to get... What the heck, guys? Yeah, and that's what I was saying. It's like, um... These people are like stormtroopers. Just blast in. Yeah, and like Arm I said, that's what's kind of weird, but that's pretty much almost how the game... Hey, look at that. Hang on. It's an x-ray of the cover art. Once oh, you really? kill these guys. Oh, man. Oh, you did blow his arm off. Oh, is that, oh, yeah, it is. So huh. that's that's like the cover art, but that's the x-ray. And there's the thumb. <laughs> yeah, I need to access the, the key code to activate a door, right? Because it's Resident Evil. Or or maybe it's um, Ring Terror's Realm. Silly Jack. See, that's what's cool is like how you can actually blow their heads off. See, earlier we were like, oh yeah, you can't shoot their arms off, and then... Yeah, but you can get headshots. Although it, I think that's really important in a game like this, to be able to get headshots. You did knock that one dude's arm off, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm still not sure if that was specific to where I shot, or if that was just random. Oh, there's there a is. hunter. Yeah. I just wanted to say your names. Bill Lewis and Zoe, and that's the thing about this game that's irritating. It's like, oh, what'd you say? Bill. Check this out! Bill. 
But then, yeah, all of a sudden they'll be talking to each other. And it's like, yeah, how's it going? How's it going? And then you shoot the guns, and it's like extremely loud. And we yeah. gotta turn the volume down. That's true. Oh yeah, here comes the horde now. Look at that! Oh, come on. Well, I'd like to think that was a headshot, but I can't see a dang thing. Wait. Wee 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 wee. Man, this game is full of butts and and uh, <laughs> squealing. You'd think that it was like deliverance or something. Yeah. Another photograph that we're not supposed to be able to see. Yeah, and that's what we were talking about before with certain games like this and Resident Evil 2. The artists and people who designed this game put so much detail and stuff in here. It's like, look at this. Isn't right. this cool? Isn't that cool? But then they blur it out so much that we can't see it. Yeah, same thing with like Resident Evil 2, though. It's like you're going through and it's like, man, look at all the graffiti and all the artwork and all the pictures of wanted posters and everything. But you can't see yeah, any of it because it's so low resolution. Yeah, and they pixelate the snot out of it. Yeah. I'll pick that up, so. Now we got a Molotov cocktail. Look here! Look here! I'm awesome! I think we just gotta pretty much follow the exit signs. And try oh, to go Great, upstairs. I always have to reload all the time. I better freaking reload as soon as I'm done here. So the power's still working. I wonder if the generator is kicked on. Yeah, maybe we blew a circuit breaker or something. Look at that. Read the meter. I'm hearing all this. You know, and that would be awesome. Like, you were saying, like, read the meter. Looks like he was puking. Yeah, it's probably. Oh, no, it's a liquor! <laughs> I'm reloading! I forgot to reload. I'm, after I'm like, yeah, I better remember to reload. I didn't. But I, what I was thinking, it's like, hey, cool, there's the meters. You can read the meters. It's like, that would have been awesome if they would have had, like, electric... Because everyone's got different clothes on if they had electricians or maintenance men down there. Yeah, that's true. That would be interesting if this game did have, like, a, oh, you got to go in and collect this file. you got to do this, you got to do that, you know, kind of thing. But you don't have to dink around. You rush in, you grab it, you keep shooting zombies, and you wait till you get anywhere to actually read it. Oh, anything. there's a tank. That's oh, what they call man. the tank. He's still going. I thought he lost an arm because it's clipping through the camera. Yeah, you probably use your health pack now. You're down in the red. Oh, yeah. What? Where are they coming from? I don't... I hear them, but oh, yeah. I don't mm -hmm. see them. I hear, like, a horde, and it's like, where? Yeah, that's one thing They're that... all upstairs. Oh, Schneiky found them! Get out of here! Yeah, and that's oh, one thing that's kind of crazy, too, is, like... We'll go into a room that's like a dead end. It's like, okay, there's nothing in here. I don't know if it's actually happened, but I feel like we'll leave. And then all of a sudden you hear, bruh, 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 and then they all come tearing out of that room. Yeah. It was like that elevator thing. It was like, I don't remember anything being in that elevator when we were on top of it. And then when we left, then something came running out of the elevator area. Oh, more of the same. And that's the thing, too. It's like, I like the the design and the look of the game but that darkness is a little bit too much yeah it's like it's so dark and it forces you to do like tunnel vision it's like looking through this tiny little peephole yeah seriously oh i was, I was already here but i didn't realize that was there oh, were we already here or no no this is probably a different area this would freak me out getting separated from everybody this is like what you don't want to do in a nightmare yeah no don't don't do that, guys. Ah, oh, I'm right over. I'm right here, guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that, Bill, Zoe, Bill, come on. It's awesome because it's like they come from all over. It's like we're in the cafeteria area. Yeah. And it's like they're just coming from at all angles. See, so yeah, here's where I think we got to go upstairs. Oh, here comes the horde now. Dang it. That horde just interrupted a joke. All right. See, it'd be funny if you could go in there and be like, look at this, and then have like a joke play out. Yeah, like a guy comes in there, or a gal, just starts making fun of me or something. That's what I love like with Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty, is they have stuff like that. He's over there puking everywhere. Whoa, good shot. Did he take out the other zombies? No, he doesn't. Baloney! <laughs> I won't stand for any of this reloading. He won't, you know. He doesn't stand for reloading. <laughs> Alright, so now we're up in the administration office. 
All right, we're in charge now. <clears throat> that's what I mean. Like, there's so much detail and stuff. Like, you could probably knock that box down with the files and everything. Unless it just stays up. It would probably fall. Yeah, like, it produces files whenever you hit it. And you, like, yeah, knock... It's, like, the... partial files. They're, like, broken or something. Is like that knocking the monitors and stuff everywhere? Yeah. It's like, it, it acts like... The game acts like it wants you to interact with the environment. He's trapped. He can't figure out how to get over it. Yeah, so a lot of these side rooms, there's nothing really in here besides, like, the zombies. Dang so it. this is where it would be, like, when you're playing online with your friends or you want to 100% or see who gets the most kills, then you would run into these side rooms and, like, just take out all the zombies. How can there be so many people in here? What are you guys doing? But like I said, with games like Resident Evil, we would come into a room and usually you collect something. But, like, with this game, a lot Dang of this cards. is, like, just nothing. Shnikes. I should have cried out or something. Oh, and here they come. Uh, if you could oh, figure out which right. which direction they're coming from, oh, that's oh, when no. you would use the Molotov cocktail and burn them all. Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, we might be able to do that in another... I feel like it's too closed off in here. We almost have to tunnel them in from somewhere. Yeah, it's like we got too many... We're the ones tunnel. They're just jumping all willy-nilly. I wish there was a separate dialogue thing, separate from your... Guns blazing. Yeah. Goosebumps Horror Land. Yeah. In Goosebumps Horror Land, you can adjust the music volume, the yeah. sound effects volume, and the voice volume. And here they come. Mazeltov! <laughs> Just put a little beanie on when you do that. <laughs> Yamaha? It's a beanie. <laughs> a bonnet? Achievement unlocked. 101 cremations. Uh, so we must have killed 101 zombies with or, uh, the Molotov cocktail. Yeah. So that's kind of cool. And that's one thing, too, that will make this game fun is trying to unlock all the achievements. So yeah, we're going to want to go up. <laughs> and that's what I read in the manual, too, is that the witch... Witches only want to be left alone so they can enjoy a good cry. They hate flashlights and loud noises. But what they hate more than anything is being shot at. There's a hunter in here. If you hear the witch tail, tell tail sobs, turn off your flashlight and try to sneak around her. If she starts to get angry, her growl will let you know she's close to attacking. So what I've done before is I just go in there and shoot the witch. What you want to do, the best thing to do, is just ignore her. So when you see her, shut off your flashlight. Oh, jeez. Here they come. Crazy music, though. Yeah, like freaking Giovanni, <laughs> whatever the heck his name is, who did 2001 Space Odyssey. All right, so we know that there's a witch, and like I was saying before, oh, grab well, whatever that thing is. Oh, it's another pipe bomb. Yeah, pipe bomb this time. And the pipe bombs are cool because when you chuck them, then all the zombies run towards that. So you'd want to do it if a horde is coming. But anyway, like I was saying with the witch, the main goal is to pretty much shut the flashlight off. Crouch down and try to sneak past her. Whoa. It's cool to kill her, and I, I think we can kill her a lot easier being on easy mode. Alright, so we need to find the exit and head upstairs. Look at that light. Do we want to kill her, or just ignore her? We can just kind of ignore her. Let's just try to go and get to the top of the roof. Because I don't even know where she's at. We might have already bypassed her. Okay, now I hear her crying. So... I like the aesthetic and it looks awesome. Like, you see all the hospital beds and everything? It's like, man, it just looks cool and looks creepy, but. Like I said, there's nothing to really interact with. He just shot the wall and it bled. Look at that biohazard. 
Yeah, infectious substance. Huh. The guy was trying to skate on the wall. That would have been awesome if they would have snuck a little Easter egg in there, but they're competitors, so they probably wouldn't do it. They should have put the uh, umbrella symbol in yeah, somewhere. Yeah, that would have been awesome. Ready to Be fight ready to fall. Oh, call, call the, the elevator. elevator. Oh, so we got to call the elevator. Oh, and they give us um, ammunition right on that table. All right, so now once we call the elevator. Oh, and then you can get your pipe bomb ready. All right, now oh, here man. they come. Oh, man. I mean, it's behind you. Oh, holy frick! Yeah, see, they all run towards the pipe bomb, and then... Oh. Oh. That's what I was saying. Yeah, now we gotta st sit here and wait for the horde. Jeez. Ah. It's like me when I'm making a film. It's like, hang on, I gotta switch out my batteries. See, now, if they were all filled up on the pipe bombs and Molotov cocktails, why aren't they throwing them? Like, that's ridiculous. Yeah. They don't, they don't do nothing. Give you pills. Give you some ecstasy. Give you a band-aid. Here, put a band-aid yeah. on it. Where'd they come from? Holy cow, there's a hole in the wall here? Hang on, I'm reloading. Yeah, I while you're reloading, hit. yeah, that's to nice that. too. Because while you're reloading, you can do the melee attack, and it's awesome because you will knock them back. That's cool. They do react to which, wherever you shoot them. I just shot him in the stomach, he's like, oh. <laughs> like I shot him, and like I shot him in the leg, and he's like limping and everything. All right, getting that elevator. Wait, I want to know what's going on over here. See, and here's where it would be kind of cool. It's like, okay, what's going on over in here now? Is there anything oh, we've to been discover? Here. But then it's like... Yeah, this is... They just tore a hole back from... And so this wall, they tore a hole in this wall. Look at that, the drywall and everything sticking <laughs> through. In, incomplete drywall. Yeah, like you said, the aesthetic of it and everything looks awesome, but you just you can't interact with anything. All right, so we're going to go to the roof, I believe, the top floor. So that's cool. You get Man. to actually look at that going up. Just don't stop talking. Peace on earth and mercy, what? mild God and sinners, huh? reconciled, joyful, all ye nations rise, <laughs> join the triumph of the skies. We should have turned subtitles on. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah, that's right. You want me to do that? Yeah, you should. Go to take options. a break. We're not even allowed to take a break. No, you're not. All right, now we should be able to see what they say when they sit there and mumble. Yeah. Roll, 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 roll. It's because he's got a smoke in his mouth. Mumble, roll. So now we got to get to the roof, the roof, the rough, the diamond in the rough. That's cool because it's like construction going on. And they got like the big spool of coax cable. Yeah, <laughs> coax cables. Yeah, they're setting up a band. For some reason I was thinking XLR. Just a big spool of XLRs. <laughs> yeah, coax cable makes sense. Fiber optics. And he's just sitting there. Huh? He's all depressed. Oh, you could jump right off that thing. This is crazy. This kind of reminds me of Zero Tolerance. Like when Boomer you could girdle? go out and look uh -oh. out over the city. Yeah, I love that look, like how you can actually step outside yeah, in the rain. Yeah, it does rain. remind me of Zero Tolerance, you're right. It's the Arclay Mountains. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I don't know where this is supposed to take place, because now there's mountains out there. Yeah, it could be L.A. It's Raccoon Hollywood. City. Was there a guy over here? Oh. <laughs> that would be freaky. Like, see a guy there and run over here, he's like, where'd he go? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, standing right up on top of that. All right, who needs the forklift? I'm gonna take it. Can't take the forklift. What's up with that? I think it's awesome when you kill a boomer. Oh, on? someone's. It's like something was happening, and then it was like. I don't know, but it triggered like. Oh, there's a safe room over 50s there. music. Oh. Yeah, that's what I was saying. They were like, oh, oh, something's happening, and you're. Yeah. <laughs> What is it, Doctor? I don't know, but it could be dangerous. Yeah, it looks like the safe room is down here. Because there's that thing on the wall right to your left when you zoomed in. Which is cool, like, it's awesome that, like, apparently the survivors painted that on the wall to let you know where the safe yeah. rooms are.
It's not even concrete, it's bags of cocaine. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Oh, you duck. You... See, that would be awesome Doctor. if you could shoot through like three or four people. Like, yeah. do a headshot and it just goes through all like three or four of them. Wouldn't that be cool to shoot that and blow that up? Or blow uh -oh. up a transformer? Tag Nabbit. I don't care if you're in my way, Bill, I'm just gonna keep firing. Stop shooting me. Jeez. Irritating. Yeah. Shoot her in the head. Ow. That's smart. Yeah. Oh, jeez. What, what, where, 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 jeez. Nice. Huh. He just explodes into pieces. It was a crazy pieces. explosion. It blew up into pieces everywhere. It's like we're in jail. That's how it feels. Yeah. It's weird because they put that door for the safe house, but then it's like there is no safe house. It's like we have to keep going. Did we miss it? Oh, right there. It's pulling Donkey Kong Country. Yeah, just keep going. Just keep going. Here's the arrow. Oh, almost to the end. No, no. Keep going. Oh, there's the door. Close that Close thing. it. Close it. Jeez. Well, that was all, all right. right. I'm going to take over and do the next all one. All right. That so, right. we're safe for now. Loading No Mercy. Number five, rooftop rooftop finale. So we're going to go to the finale mm -mm -mm. and tear through the rooftop. I don't know what's going on because this is a blind playthrough. Mm -hmm. 